Hi everyone, I'm Beth Robinson and I am an independent Stampin' Up! demonstrator and I wanted to welcome you to another episode of Lizzie Stamps. Today we are going to play with the new Stampin' Up! August, December 2020 mini catalog. Sneak peek. I have lots to show. I'm really excited to show you what we have in store. So bear with me. I have a lot of things to share with you what's coming out in the mini catalog. And if you would like a catalog, you need to let me know. I'll put um, below in the description of this um, video where you can get a copy of the new catalog where you can just shoot me an email. And August 1st is when the catalog will go live and it'll be good through December of this year. Lots of fun things with Christmas, Halloween, Thanksgiving, fall, winter. There's a lot of new exciting fun things to show. So I'm gonna go ahead and we're gonna get started. So I'm gonna switch over Bear with me. There we go. Okay, so now you can see me right here. All right, and I'm gonna go ahead and start off with, and how I'm doing this, if once you get the catalog, you can see I, I'm going in order of what I pre-ordered. So you might be able to um, follow along. So the beauty about being a demonstrator is that we were able to pre-order a lot of the new products. So the first thing I'm sharing with you is the Joy of Sharing card kit. It makes 15 traditional cards or they could be photo cards. Um, they're five by seven in size and you'll see this, they're five by seven. So they have a nice mossy meadow um, card front and then you'll see the gold overlays so this comes out let's see if I can get it out just so you can see what it looks like it has beautiful pine cones and leaves so it would fit like this and then it has embellishments to add to it it's an all-inclusive card set, so you get a block, which is very nice to have, and you get your Mossy Meadow Stampin' Spot. So you can bring this with you anywhere you go because it's all-inclusive. It has everything that you need. So here are some beautiful real red labeled pieces, and you have some more real red banner and pieces, and... Here are some gold circular embellishments. Let's see if you can see that. There you go. Okay, and then you have these pre-cut pine cones and berries and poinsettias. And you get one, two, three, I think you get six sheets of those for the cards. So to make 15 cards, and all the instructions are here in the little leaflet that comes with it and it's numbered so you can see you can coordinate the numbers with um, the steps so here over here the numbered steps you just follow along and then you can use the greetings to make the different cards. So there's one, two, two different, and there's two more on the back, three and four, showing that you can make it with the photo card and without. Okay, so that's the all-inclusive kit, which these are one of my favorites and it comes in this great cardboard box. All right, another stamp set is the tag buffet and it is actually um, a project kit which when I was ordering this is what happens sometimes is I forgot to order the whole kit um, but it does 
come, it makes 30 tags, but this is the stamp set that goes with it. So I'm gonna be ordering the kit now since I didn't put in the right number. That happens sometimes, but I, I think that's really pretty. And it does have matching embellishments for the tags. So everything comes together with that. The tags are already pre-cut and it has ribbon to go with it. And then one of our um, returning is the most wonderful time product medley. And this came out in last um, mini, the mini catalog last winter. Um, so really great stamp set, photopolymer. And then it has the matching most wonderful time dies that go with it. So you can stamp your presents and then cut them out, which is nice. And then you have your tree that you can cut out. You have an angel and your star. And then, so it cuts out this other tree as well. So you could make a cluster of trees. So that's a really, it's really nice. It made some great cards. I should have showed you the cards that I made last year. But also it comes with this glitter ribbon. This is a fun tinsel. It's got a clear and glitter together and, it, and it's wired. So that's fun to use. And then the paper, it came with paper and your card backings. So you'll see that you have these various cards that you can adhere to the card bases. It has stickers. So I didn't use this, I have still a lot. Oh, here's the paper, really pretty. This is really great. I'm glad they brought this back because these actually are very pretty and the framelits will cut out the presents, which are nice. The dies, I should say, not framelits. But anyway, really fun gold foil. You can see those. So there's, there's a lot in this pack. I think it came with 48 sheets. So I used it quite a bit. It was fun. Okay, and it's great to use with our note cards and envelopes. I'm a big fan of that. And then you have these cute little gold um, self-adhesive um, embellishments. So you can see I've used them and they do have the backing on that. So those are in there. And so anyway, that's an, a favorite that's come back. So our next one is, this is a, a suite as well, but I didn't order the whole suite. It's called the um, Heartwarming Hugs Suite. And it comes with um, some cute coffee cups. It comes with dies and a stamp set um, for the coffee cups and it with a little coffee cup holder. That I didn't get that yet. I might get the rest of it, but I just thought the paper for sure I would get um, and the textured embossing folders, um, which is nice because when our new st stamp and cut and emboss machines come out, we have a mini. So these will work in the mini and these are really nice. These are um, wrapped in texture embossing folders. So one you see that the, has these four dots together patterned but they're nice and deep. And then this is another textured one. I really love, it's almost like a basket weave. It's really pretty. So you have those, and then you've got the ribbons. This is the 3 8 inch moss. It's with Wisp Whisper White. So you have this kind of stripe, and then on the other side, more of a white stripe with the, with the mossy meadow background. So I love that. You get a lot of this ribbon. And then you have this beautiful braided linen ribbon, and it's same with our braided linen that we have in the mini catalog, but this, or in the, the annual catalog, but this has, this is red instead of just the linen color. So I really like playing with that. That's a nice too. And then the designer paper is designer series paper that goes with the suite, but I just really wanted to get the paper. I felt like I could use it a lot but it has um, the traditional colors, real red, pear pizzazz, and mossy meadow. So you get 12 seat sheets, and so you get two of each of the six designs. So you have this stripe that incorporates the mossy meadow, the pear pizzazz, 
and the real red. And then on the other side, you have this nice herringbone, pear pizzazz, and mossy meadow. And the next color, you have a nice dotted pattern with the mossy meadow background with pear pizzazz dots. And on the other side, you have this wonderful checked plaid pattern. And the next one is just the, the real red with white. And on the other side, you have this great stripe. So you could even wrap presents in this. I think it's so fun. And then here, this is a nice textured, um, has incorporates all the colors. And on the back, you have this wonderful check, mossy meadow check. And then the next one is this one. And then with the stripe. And it'd be great to use with um, the ornament punches that we have. I think that would be fun to make different colored, you know, patterned ornaments. It'd be fun to do that. And then you have this pattern and on the other side. Look at that. That's it's really neat. Incorporating just three colors. And there's one stripe, and that was the other. So you got that's a nice little pack of paper, and I really like that. I'm I might get the rest of the suite, but I'm not sure. Okay, so the next one is going to be our gift wrap bundle. And remember when you have a bundle, a bundle is usually a stamp set with a punch or dies, but a suite incorporates the paper, the ribbon, and the embellishments. So you can just buy the bundle within the suite that is being offered, or you can buy the whole suite. So this is a bundle. So this is our new gift wrap stamp set with the gift bow builder punch. And what I like about this is there's the little tie for the ribbon, but then you also have these tags. So it's a cute little tag right here. And you can add the little holly or the stars. I think it's really, really cute. Um, I really wish it would have come out with paper with this. But again, it looks like it's a, it's a nice punch. And you know when you open and close the punches, you push down and close down to lay it flat. So that's our gift wrapped bundle. And the next one is going to be our Dove of Hope. Here we go. Dove of Hope. I am actually making 600 Christmas cards and I'm gonna be using this stamp set with another stamp set I'll be showing you. But this is, I love the hand-drawn dove and the different ways holding the olive branch. And then here in flight, I love the writing. I think there's a lot you could do with this. But what's even better is that the dies will make like a 3D dove. And that's what I'm gonna be making and it's gonna be an ornament. Um, so it'll be enclosed in the mini paper pumpkin box and the nativity scene bundle that I'm going to show you will be on top. But this is really pretty. I think this is going to be a very well used set for a lot of people. And the fact that you can make and I mean, it like to make a gold foil dove or, you know, it'd be really pretty that just I think it's going to be fun. So I'm excited to get with that. All right, so now we are going to go on to another suite. And this is a really fun suite. This is called Poinsettia Place Suite. So it comes with the poinsettia, or poinsettia, if you notice, poinsettia, petaled, stamps, petal stamp set. And you have a lot of variety. So you have your lined image and then your fill. So, which is given a nice brush effect and the same with the poinsettias. And then you have the berries here, so layers. So I really like that. Two-step stamping is what we call it. And you have all of these dies. These dies are incredible. So you can make 3D um, poinsettias. And then you'll notice here you have your outline in your poinsettia and then you have your inside and this one 
doesn't cut, but it's going to embellish, it's going to emboss the uh, flower for you. So then you have your cluster of berries, same here. You have your ones that will cut out, and then this one is the one that you will, um, that will emboss. And then this one right here embosses, there's another emboss, and then your leaves as well, your holly leaves. Do the same thing, this is cutting out and this is embossing. So really nice stamp set um, with the dies. You get a lot with this set. So with that, you have your designer paper. And this designer paper is the Poinsettia Place paper. It has bumblebee, garden green, old olive, real red, and soft suede in it. I'm not sure I understand. Oh, sorry about that. So here you have a layer of holly leaves clustered. On the other side, just a nice design. With this one, you have the pine cones with the, the pine needles. And on the other side, the pine needles just itself. And here you have the poinsettias with the background, which is really pretty. That's the old olive background, the garden green. You have the bumblebee berries. And then again, you have another design on that side. And here are some other poinsettias that are bigger. I really like these. And then you have just the, the look, you know, the, the berries with the leaves. And this one, just the berries, it's so pretty. These are just the berries itself. And then you have a wood grain on the back. And then the last one are smaller poinsettias with the pine needles. And then you have the pine cones. So what I love too, and Stamping Up is starting to do this a lot more, is they are showing how versatile these dies can be with not just stamps, but with the paper. This paper is really, really pretty. This is like a glassine, um, um, what am I thinking of? Anyway, but it has felt, but it's like a glassine feel. Um, this is a specialty paper. It's called the Plush Poinsettia Specialty Paper. You get six in a pack and two of each design. So here you have the poinsettias. But what I love about this is that the poinsettia die will cut these out. You can, and also if you wanna make it red, but just have a little bit of 3D with the felt, you can just sponge on there and then put it on a card. It's really pretty. And you have, so it's really nice because you're gonna be able to cut out these. And then the next one is this really cool filigree design. I really like that one. That's a great background. And then the last one, you have your berries and your holly leaves. And again, the frame or the dies will cut these out. So I really love versatility. I think that's really important when you're buying a big suite like this. So the next thing that I have are these beaded pearls and there's three, a cluster of three that rest in a silver um, base. So they're very pretty. I can hold this up just a little bit. So there you go. So really pretty, you receive 18 of these. And this can be like a cluster, you know, that you, you put on a cluster of the poinsettias. And then that would be the flower centers. So they're really pretty. I really like those. And then you have this beautiful 3 8 inch real red sheer ribbon. It's very, and it's beautiful. It's got a little bit of sheen to it. So it's nice, it's, so I really like that one. All right, so that's a big suite. I, that's probably gonna be one of my favorites. I can't wait to start working on that one. Okay, the next one I have is, this was the nativity scene that I was telling you about, um, which I really, I, it's very pretty. And I think it's gonna be another favorite for a lot of people. 
So you have Mary and Joseph and the baby, and then you have your stable and the rejoice. For unto us a child is born, and may his light shine in your heart throughout the year. And then you have a donkey and the lamb, and you have a couple of the stars. And then the framelits, so you have the palm trees, and then the cutout for the lamb and the donkey, the cutout for the stamped stable and Mary and Joseph as well or you can just you can just run this and this is the back entrance where you can have it layered so you can actually stamp the stable and then layer it over this embossed it, so it already will emboss it for you so it's looking like a 3d image it's really pretty so that's I'll be using this one 600 times to make so that'll be fun Okay, so then the next one is this triangle, tree triangle. And I thought this would be really fun because they are offering as well with, um, they're offering red and green foil sheets, okay? So you can get a pack of the sheets. It comes in a four pack, two red, two green. And this stamp set works well with the stitched triangles dies that are in the annual catalog so it's fun to make a background um, but using the foil i would do probably something um, where you versamark with clear but you can stamp the red on the red or the green on the green um, and that would be fun to use and here you have some great poinsettias and then you've got some leaves here so there's a lot you can do with this and then the ornaments. So it's it's a nice set. And then so the triangle, uh, stitch triangle dies, that, that would be really pretty. And then accented with the red and green foil sheets. So we have that. And then our next one is the trimming the town suite. Again, a suite we have embellishments, ribbons, stamp set, dies, and this is a making a difference stamp set. So um, Stampin' Up! is going to give $3 for every sale of this stamp set. You can buy the stamp set or the suite, but every time you buy this, $3 will go to um, different charities devoted to Adoption, foster care, and infertility. So they, they will divvy it up. But I think that's really great. It's a, it's a nice stamp set, um, lined. It's, you know, very, you know, as we call it, geometric, you know, with the simple lines. But it's, it's fun. It just has a lot of um, unique qualities to it, and especially the paper. So here you have the coming home stamp set. And then with the um home together dies so you have the different kind of dies this actually you can make um in the catalog when you're able to see it these actually like are a little box you can make um, but then you also have these sloped with the leaves with the trees and then just this you know if you wanted to make a, a hill a snowbank um, that's really fun to use. And then you've got your tree sizes, your tree, there's your car, all the dies that match the houses when you stamp them. But the other beauty of this again is that the paper can, the dies can be used to cut out some of the paper. But here are, here's some designs of the paper and the colors of, um, I didn't put the colors in. But the colors of the paper, let me just tell you on the back of this. Oops, I hope I didn't bang that too. So the colors are Early Espresso, Misty Moonlight, Old Olive, Pool Party, Poppy Parade, and Whisper White. Those are the colors used. So here you have a group of houses. And on the other side, it's snowflakes. And then you have a group of people some hugging, some holding presents. It's cute, some giving presents. I think it's a really cute sheet. And on the other side, just this nice stripe. 
here you have a cluster of the trees. So there's a lot you could do with this. If you have a snowbank, and then you could have this being behind the snowbank with the houses, I think that's cute. And then you have the red with the white dots. And then this one is the um, wreaths. So those are great to cut out. And the wreath die cuts out these wreaths, which I think is really nice to have. And then on this side, you have all these writings in French, Dutch, German, um, and English. So you can cut them out. So it's versatile for all different sayings, but you can, you can fussy cut these out if you'd like. All the different tidings of joy, uh, have a merry little Christmas. So there's a, little, a lot of the season's greetings, a lot of different sayings in this. Now, these houses right here, the dyes will cut out these houses and the trees. So you could cut everything out. It's, that's just, just makes me so happy. So, and then on the other side, you have this nice little striped piece. And then this one, so especially for those who are scrapbookers, this is a really neat piece, but you can cut apart this if you wanted to, but this is a nice, um, 12 by 12 piece that gives the whole uh, image. And then on the back, you have these swirly lines. I think those are cute too. So that's the paper. And then you have these adhesive backed flat dots and stars and a matte finish. You have two sizes in the real red and white. And then you have the stars in bumblebee. And that's nice. So you get, um, how many pieces do you get? You get a hundred pieces here. So, but you get the two designs of the circle of the dots and then you have the stars. So that's nice too. Then you have a ribbon combo pack. And I am all about satin ribbon with gold. Actually, this has, um, Gold, yes, it's gold trimmed. So you have Poppy Parade, which I love that they did it in not a real red or cherry cobbler, but Poppy Parade with the gold trim. And this is a satin, this is an eighth of an inch satin ribbon. And then your old olive. So really nice. So I am big into paper and um, ribbon packs. You get more bang for your buck. So you're, there's a lot you can do with this. So that's a fun suite to do. Okay, so we finished that one. Now we're on to Christmas Means More stamp set. <clears throat> but I did group some things with it um, that can go together. Um, I think I just, this is a really fun stamp set with the different writings, but I believe it's silly, but I believe, I think that's cute. And you have the bells and then you have Holly with the berries and here and every, I really just love the sayings in this. And what's nice about this is that the stitched, the love, the stitched, um, lovely label stitched dies from, it can go with this. I think it's nice. Uh, it would look, look really, really pretty. And then there's another um, die that I'll show you that can go with this stamp set. So, and then you have these beautiful adhesive back iridescent snowflakes. So they're really, really pretty. I, I love how you get, I think you get, let's see how many do you get of these? 260, so there are a lot. But it'd be also fun to use with the triangle trees um but also to add to these cards so anyway the what the light shines you get a different color so i think that's really pretty all right and then you have this is new and i'm really excited about this but you get this is six by twelve and these are felt sheets and then you get four sheets in a pack you get just jade real red whisper white and early espresso so also with that other um, trimming the town suite, that's where you could use the white and make you know the hillside of snow if you wanted to. So this is gonna be great. You can use it through our, with our dies or you can create your own design with paper snips, you know, cut out strips 
um, you'll see in the catalog they they show different ways you can use the felt so that's fun so those are those products okay then the next one is the wonder of the season sweet this is a big big sweet this is a big huge sweet so you get a lot with this suite. So I'm going to start with, you get, actually, if you buy the whole suite, you get two um, stamp sets with matching dies. And this is also includes the memories and more cards. So I'm going to get, I'm going to show you a little bit. But, so the first one is our Wishes and Wonder um, stamp set with the North Pole Wonder dies. So I'm going to show you what the dies look like. So you'll see that the dies, you know, you have your cutout of a deer right here, a reindeer with antlers, but then you also can stamp, you can cut out the stamped image as well. And then the sleigh, and then it has this really neat tag. I think it's nice with a hole, but so it'll punch the hole for you. Again, you have this sunburst outline image but then you also have the tag with the hole and then you have a circle right here and then you have these beautiful leaves and then the cluster of this cluster right here can be cut out with the dies right there I think there's a lot to this and I think it's really I think it's really nice so you could do use the tags and actually the tags that I bought that with I could use this set with that stamp set so all right, then the next stamp set that you get with this is the Cherish the Season stamp set. And it has the beautiful bells and pine needles and to and from. And again, using this stamp set with the tag, with the tag dies that come in here. So I'm, I think it's loving that you can use both. And then on the inside you have the beautiful bells that are already with the embossed, and that's beautiful, and then the pine needles. And then right here you have this image. I wonder what that, actually this can go on the bell if you want it to. So we'll have to play with that. No. But that's, I would just, I would use gold, the brushed gold paper, or any, any, we, it's really pretty. Okay, so those are the two stamps that you, you get with it. And then you get the um, Wonder of the Season specialty paper. Okay, when we mean specialty is that it's got um, some gold foil or you saw with the felt earlier. So this one is really neat. It's a whimsical text. Um, in English, French, German, and Dutch with vintage designs. So the colors are basic black, gold foil, red foil, and whisper white. So you're going to see what I'm saying. So here, here is um, just if you were really want to read it, but it's all about Santa up in his workshop. And then on the other side, you have like a chronicle, like a newspaper, and then you have it in different languages in the black and then this one is a gold one this is upside down gold foil and beauty See, you have your right there you have your bells but then just a little bit of writing um this is very pretty very vintage -y. um i'll have to read through it i haven't really read through what it really says and on the back you have a black and white image so it's almost like um these are little articles in a newspaper and then here, this is the red foil. And this one is all ingredients in different languages, which I think is genius. So you could actually just cut it and have it on the side. I mean, that's sort of nice. It's, it's like you're giving a gift within a gift of your card. And then here, the night before Christmas, um, but really just fun. And then here's another one with the reindeer. So this is nice. 
and red foil. And then back here, you have this beautiful, whimsical writing. Love that. And then here's another red foil. It's fun because you can really just cut this apart and have it as a background. And then you have the black and white. This is another recipe page side. And then here you have the gold foil one. Really, it's pretty, pretty paper. I'm really loving it. Okay, so that is one set. That's the paper. i put that to the side. Then you have your Tis the Season paper pack, six by six. It comes with 48 sheets. There's four sheets of 12 designs. So you have basic black, real red, cherry cobbler, garden green, and shaded spruce in this pack of paper. So I'm just gonna show you the designs here. And you can tell the pattern this year, a lot of holly berries and um, leaves and wreaths. I think it's really pretty. So you have that and the candy canes. I think that's a really cute one. And here, this one has stars and a diamond pattern. And here is your whimsical real red with white. Okay, sorry about that. And then if you have, um, here you have the a stripe with dotted pattern and on the other side you have this beautiful whimsical snowflake. It's got these berries in the middle. I think that's really cute. And here's this one. And on the other side, is this nice diamond pattern. And then this one I think is so pretty with the red and the green. It's really, I love that. And then you have a plaid pattern on this side, incorporating all the colors. And here again, another whimsical. I call it whimsical just with the, the curlies. I love that. And then this one, oh, look at that. That is great. You could just do strips of the candy canes. That would be a great border. Then this one is another with the cherry cobbler embedded with the real red. That's pretty. And then on this one, just a cluster of trees. And here's another pattern. And again, on the other side, you have all the holly leaves with cherry cobbler on a red, red background. It's this one and oh the bells I'll have to see I'm if the bells if they cut they'll cut out with this I'm not quite sure I'd have to look at at the die set and see but I think the pine needles will cut out with this paper so I love that and on the background it's just very fine little dots and lines and here's this one with the reindeer and the pine needles and the holly berries and leaves. And then here you have the colored holly berries and leaves. And then on the other side, another plaid. So those are the colors of that. Then you get <clears throat> the memories and more card packs. I really like using these. You get two different sizes of the cards. You get a, let's see, you get a three by four. And then these are great, so you can use them for scrapbooking or for card making. These are great for layering. So they're double-sided. And then you also get a size, a four by six side. And oh, look at this. I haven't really looked at these yet, but look at that gold foil. Oh, and then that's just blank on the, but look at that. Those are just, well, and look at this one. So what's great is that there's a paper, there's a envelope and um, card kit that goes with this and has red foil. So you could actually just put this on just like that. I mean, that, that in itself and add some of the ribbon and the embellishments, really pretty. Um, but this has red, I love it. This can be photo ready, you can put your, photo card in there if you wanted to and then look at the envelope look at the flap it has the red foil it's so pretty and those are great these come with um, 20 I mean 
some people just send out 20 cards, but that would be really great to have. And then in here, they also have stickers. So you have your stickers, wonder, joy, believe with the reindeer. You get two sheets of that and then you've got numbers. So that's nice to have. And then you also get, let's see where, oh, you get another, here's some more. So here's some more. These are all sticker backed, so they just slap right on your card. All right, so that's what we have with those. So that Memories and More pack is so versatile. Look at this one. Merry Christmas. And it's got the gold inlay. That's really fun. I'm, I love, I love these paper packs. I think they're really great. Okay. Then you have these beautiful embellishments. They're faceted gems with gold flecks in them. There's real red and white, but you, can you see those? Can you see the flecks? Oh, I just love these. These, these are great. I, I think this is really, really fun to have. So you have those. Um, and then you have the Wonder of the Season ribbon pack. So here we have the gold cording, which we had, I don't know if it was last season or the season before, but this is nice. I really like the gold cording. And then this is really pretty. This is our shaded spruce. It's an inch. It's an argyle patterned satin ribbon. So you have the flat side, but then you have this raised side of the argyle pattern. I think that's really, and it's nice. I, I love the inch. I love the big, thick inch ribbon. So there's a lot you can do with this. So I'm, that's, again, another fun pack I'm really excited to play with. Put all this away. Okay, so then we have the For Unto Us um, stamp set. This is, again, an any what we call an any and Audi stamp set. So you have, oh, come let us adore him and share with the glory, wonder, and miracle of the holy season. This goes well with the nativity scene as well. That So this writing is really nice to have. So um, the innies and outies. For us, a child is born. But you can tell which ones go together. It's, it's really nice. It's very pretty. So I will be using this when I'm making my card. And then this is a really fun, this is an evergreen forest 3D embossing folder. But I, what I really like about what they did when I opened this up, I said, oh my goodness. So instead of having the trees go this way, they're going this way. And this is going to be, I mean, because it is a 3D embossing folder in our new stamp and cup, cut emba and emboss machine, I think it's, it's just going to be stunning. I mean, to use some of the metallic papers with this or your, you know, with shaded spruce. This is just, I think this is really pretty. I think it's fun. So that's gonna be really, and when you look at this, you can sort of see that there is going to be dimension when you run it through. So there's gonna be different, I think, raised images. So I think this is gonna be a big seller. So I'm really liking that one. All right, now, our next one, okay, this is a fun one because it's not using the traditional colors. We're using lots of blues and purples. Get it all. But this is our Snowflake Splendor Sweet. So you will really, really like this. So let's start with the stamp set first. <clears throat> lots of different snowflakes. Love it. Love the writing. Even Happy Hanukkah. So they're incorporating other holidays than just Christmas. So I really like that. Um, but you have the cluster of snowflakes. I, this is, I think, really fun. And then look at the dies that you get. 
I think this one is really neat. This is like an outline, um, but that's great for the writing in the middle. And then you've got more snow, you have a slew of snowflake dies. You have ones for the outline for some of the images that you can stamp, but what's even better is the pattern, the, special, the designer paper, you can use the dies to cut them out. Let me just show you this as an example. So there you go. Isn't that great? So that one, I mean, just the, you know, just to be able to cut these out. Oh, I just love that. And then this other die cuts out this one. How fun is that? There we go. So that cuts out. And then you also have the little tiny one and that cuts out this one. How special, I mean, I am like all for it. I think it's just great. But the paper itself is really pretty. The colors that are included in this, Highland Heather, Pool Party, Coastal Cabana, Balmy Blue, Pacific Point, Misty Moonlight, Night of Navy. What's our theme here? Blues. Blues, really pretty colors. So that's one side, and look at this one, just the splattering. That'd be a beautiful sky with the nativity scenes. Oh. There's a lot you can do with it. Okay, then you have the next one. Look at these. Oh, really, really pretty. And then flip it over. And again, you have another washing of, of the color. This is Coastal Cabana. Really pretty. And then here you have these. And look at that cluster. So using Pacific Point, Coastal Cabana, um, Maybe a little Knight of Navy, beautiful. Here we have some more. It's really pretty. And then the back of this one is more flat. Oh, but just this piece right here makes you shiver. It's cold, but it's beautiful though. So I think these papers are really, really pretty. You know this one? And on the back of that, oh, the snowflakes with the Highland Heather, the Pacific Point, the Misty Moonlight. It's all, they're, all the colors are incorporated. Oh, this one is one of my favorites. It's almost like they're stamped on a canvas. If you look at the paper, you can't really see. I don't know if you can see, but it is have a canvas back. And then this beautiful night sky. That's really pretty. So... That's fun. And then included with the suite is balmy blue glitter paper. We love glitter. How about with those snowflakes? It's gonna be stunning. Really like it. And then we have our winter snow embossing folder. This is nice. Has all the different pattern snowflakes, but that's a really nice background. I would even use the glimmer paper and put it through the machine with this embossing folder. I think that would be pretty. Okay, then we have the quarter inch ribbon. It's an iridescent ribbon with metallic thread woven in. So I'm gonna really put that up there so you can see it. It's a little more stiff um, but I think it's, it's, it's nice and it's very iridescent. So it does have the colors of all the, the colors in the designer paper. It's really, that's really cool. I think that's really nice. And that's a quarter of an inch. So it's a nice wide ribbon to use. And then you have these beautiful blue adhesive back gems. Um, so you have the balmy blue and the night of navy, but they're iridescent. So again, adding that to the cards, that, that's really pretty. And you get 120 of these. So you have this size and this size, but you have one side is the balmy blue, the other side is the night of navy with the iridescent. So, so that's that sweet. Okay. We're getting there, we're almost finished. I had to write everything down because I don't have my catalog yet, so I was having to make sure I wrote everything down. Now you have this stamp set. 
with, um, this is a bundle. So the ornamental envelopes. Um, this is gonna be fun because you can decorate your envelopes. Um, there's also some writing, like if you wanna stamp that on the front of your card and write um, the address. But then you have a cluster of ornaments and you also have these other corner designs. And then the framelit, or the dies, sorry, but they are dies so you can use inside pattern paper and make your design um, for the inside of the envelope or the outside. So here for the three by three envelope that we have, that's really great to use. And here is the die cut for the um, cluster of ornaments. And then you have this really, this is nice. You can just actually put this on the, you know, you could use it on the flap of your envelope or you can use in this one as well, or you can use it on, with pattern paper and just put it on. So the, I think there's a lot that you can use with this, but it's fun. Um, so you have the different scalloped designs and sizes. So for inside the envelope or outside the envelope. So I think there's a lot that's gonna, you can do with that. So I think that's really fun to use. Okay, so we're gonna move on to autumn. lost my gems hold on okay all right we're getting there here we go so this is the gilded autumn suite and you have the bundle here but you have three punches that go with this so here you have beautiful autumn and then again, this is two-step stamping. You notice that you have the outline image and then you have the fill. And then you've got two leaf and an acorn punch. So those are nice to have. And then with this, I'm gonna go ahead and show you, but this paper pack, and you can use this a lot. This is our brushed metallic paper. You have gold copper, and bronze. So bronze is a newer color. It almost looks like copper, but this is actually the copper one. But it's brushed, so I don't know if you can see the lines through it. And that matches with the beautiful um, Gilded Autumn Specialty Paper. There's elegant designs and earthy colors, so mint macaron, Cajun Craze, Crumb Cake, Early Espresso, and Very Vanilla. And then you have copper and gold foil on some of the designs. And some of the images can be punched out with those punches that you get. So here's the gourds that have a gold inlay. And on the other side is a nice speckled pattern. And then this is beautiful with the leaves. And this is using either the bronze, probably the bronze, with the mint macaron background. And then you have this herringbone background right here with early espresso. And then this one, oh, this has the copper and the gold. Look at that, that is just beautiful with the very vanilla background. And then here you have the stripes, Cajun Cray, cra um, crumb cake, and then mint macaron and early espresso. And then the very vanilla background. And this is nice too, this is just a, it almost looks like a cluster of flowers together, but that's nice with the Cajun craze background. And then, so here is when they're saying, so these can be punched out with those three, the trio of punches that you get. So I think that's fun. You could just make the, the background and these as well. So versatility, that's my favorite. So here you have, this is all the foiled inlay images, but you can punch them out with the, um, punches. And then you have the last one. It's similar to this one, but in your mint macaron, Cajun craze, early espresso, crumb, crumb cake, and then very vanilla background. And then look at this. Look at that on the mint macaron background with the gold inlay. So really, those are, that's really great, great paper. I think that's really, really pretty. 
Then you get these really great, they're heavy, they're antique copper, um, make sure they're copper or they go, they're, hold on, it's, okay. This is the antique copper finish and there's a ring on top for easy tying and you get um, 20 of these, but they're acorn trinkets. So that would be cute. And I'll tell you, they are pretty heavy. And then last but not least, another combo ribbon pack, which is great. Here is, and if you remember our copper foil ribbon that we had, um, this one is really pretty. This has, um, a, this is another copper ribbon and in a shiny metallic. So I was trying to see if you could spread it apart like we, you can on the other end, but you can fray it. So, but I think that's really pretty. It's pliable, so it's gonna be easy to use. Then you have this beautiful mint macaron, um, soft woven. This is really nice, soft woven. So again, you have your flat side and then you have your raised side. So I, I love that it's got a 3D feel. Um, and this is a half inch. So you get a lot of that. So again, so my sweets, the sweets that they have, I'm really excited to play with. Um, I'll be starting probably with the autumn first, but I'm gonna have to be making cards out of all of them. Okay. Then, so that's the autumn sweet, then the loves of the leaves. This is a nice little set. Um, I do love the images of the leaves and the very, I love the writing. And, but you can use, it would be pretty to use the paper from the Gilded Autumn, definitely. And um, here are the, and it's great. These are stitched. Um, they have stitched leaf dies. And then look at this. This is a stitched image that you can put on the front of a card. But here again, you have the stitched leaf and then the outline stitched leaf. So that's really fun. So this would be one that embosses the leaf and then you would cut it out. So that's, those are, these are the um, autumn or the stitched leaf dies. So, okay. So with that, that's really fun. And then I have this one. This is a nice stamp set. Life is beautiful. This is actually <clears throat> when you have this $1 million logo on and I forget who, who designed this, but when you earn a million dollars with stamping up, you get to design your own stamp set. So I think this is really it's for all the seasons. So you have your snowflakes, your leaves, and then this is a cluster of leaves or berries, but it all adds to the, I just love the tree. I love the way that it looks like it's swaying a little bit. And the hello, thinking of you and life is beautiful. And then you have the birdhouse with the birds. So I think that's a really pretty stamp set. But what's nice too, is you can use the stamp set with, this is our um, vanilla cards with quarter, coordinating metallic gold envelopes. So you have detailing on the cards in gold foil, and it's the right size to put in a, a photo if you'd like, or a stamped image. So you get 10, and this is a brushed gold envelope. So you get 10 envelopes and cards. So I think that's gonna be really nice to go with that. Okay. So then the plaid tidying suite. Okay, again, this is another um, set that has a six by six pack of 48 sheets of paper, but let's start with the celebration tidings. I think this is really fun. It's not just for, it's you've got a little bit of Halloween and you have fall and you have Christmas in here so and i love that merry christmas so i think that's really neat and then you have the this is what's really cool these are the new celebration label dies now when i noticing at first i'm like these are really big but 
when you use this, you'll notice there's two indents right here and that's for easy folding. So for people who are giving like cookies or, you know, gift wrapping and you can use our cellophane envelopes, um, this would be great for bat, you know, to put the label on. And that's what these labels, if you'll notice that this, you can see, you can stamp the image on this, on either side. So you can, this is for your biggest one, but this is also great for labeling on the cards. So um, if you're late, this is really great. And you have your heart and you have your um, spider cut out. So um, I think this is fun. So you get two spider cutouts there and two heart cutouts. So that's always nice to have. So that matches together. And then we have our Tis the Season, or Plaid Tidings, I'm sorry, designer paper. You get 48 sheets. You get four of each design. So these are all the colors that are used in here. Cherry Cobbler, Melon Mambo, Blackberry Bliss, Shaded Spruce, Pretty Peacock, Bumblebee, and Pumpkin Pie. So all aspects of the seasons. So here you have just, I'm gonna go through these quickly so you can see them. There we go. Just so nice. And on the other side, black and white, Halloween, here's fall. This would be great to use with those stitched leaves, dyes. Here's this one. I uh, just I love the colors that they incorporated in all of it. And all the different plaid patterns. This one. Here we go there. And our last one. So, incorporates Halloween, fall, and Christmas in this paper. And then we have this beautiful 3 8 of an inch embroidered ribbon. It's a natural open weave with rustic um, embroidered design. So that's really just, it's nice. You can see that embroidered design. So that's that. Okay, we're almost finished. We're on our last, our last one. Okay, banner year bundle set. In the annual catalog, we had a new punch that came out, our lovely label punch, but this one is a banner punch and it goes with this banner year stamp set. So I really like that it incorporates again, Halloween, fall, and um, Christmas, and the little images, and the banners, which are great. So who, a lot of people got tired of just you know, how I did it when you were making your banners, you would cut in the middle and cut the points, but now you can make your own. So you have your half inch, three quarter inch, or one inch width. So you have your any banner or your Audi banner, as I call them. And this again is really nice. So you have the two different designs and it's already indented for you for all the different widths. So anyway, so that is the last one. And it's a lot, but now I get to start playing, but I really wanted to show you some of the great things that are coming out in the catalog um, starting August 1st. And if you need a catalog, please let me know if you need one and I can send one to you. You can follow me at Lizzie Stamps, Stampin' Up on Facebook. And you can also follow me at Lizzie Stamps on Instagram. But I would love to hear from you. So in the description below, I'm going to put um, my website down there and it has a contact me button that you can go ahead and let me know if you would like a catalog. Thanks for sticking with me. Hope you enjoyed it. Have a great day and I'll see you soon.